Hi, I'm Dr. Lisa Thompson of DrLisaMThompson.com and I have a question for you. Are you struggling with coming up with content on a consistent basis that your target market is looking for? Well, pay close attention because in this video I'm going to show you how to leverage the site search on Google Analytics that will help you see in real time what your target market is looking for when they are on your blog. So if you haven't set up your Google Analytics account, go set that up right now. All you need to do is go to YouTube and you can type in Google Analytics Setup and it'll walk you through how to do that. Once you have it set up, you're going to be coming to a screen just like this and you want to click on the Admin tab and it's going to bring you to this screen here. So you want to make sure you navigate to the view you want your site search set up on. So if you have your blog, you want to make sure that you have your account set up. And then you want to come over here to where it says View Settings. And you want to click on that. And it's going to take you to this view right here. And what we want to focus on is we want to come down to where it says Site Search Settings. And when you have are down right down here on this page, what I want you to do is make sure that site search tracking is turned on. And then you're going to put in the query parameter, I'm just going to make this a little bit bigger here for you, is you want to put the letter S, a small S with no quotes, okay? And the reason we want to put a small S in the query parameter is because you are using WordPress. Most of you who are using the blog are using the WordPress feature. So that's what you need to use to track your search terms is just put the little s in there and then come down, click save, and then you are done. And I'm just going to quick bring this back here a little bit. And then what you're going to do is to find what people are searching for, you're going to come down here to where it says site search and then you're going to select on search terms. Now I just set mine up so if you don't see it right away don't panic it's going to take some time for Google to go through and go through your site to find out what search terms your traffic is looking at. So it might take a day or two or more but then what you need to do is once a week go over to your Google Analytics account and then check and see here what are the search terms that people are typing into your website that they're looking for? And then what you can do then is start creating content around those search terms. And then you're going to be able to increase your chances of landing on the first page of Google and getting targeted, high quality traffic that will get you leads and sales for your business. Did you find this video helpful today? leave a comment and share. And if you'd like to get more information and training on how to build your business using a blog and other tools, what I want you to do is I want you to head over to drlisamthompson.com forward slash get MLSP and you're going to come to a page once you fill in your information you're going to get a video that's going to explain everything of how you can have the tools, training, and community that can help you take your blogging to the next level to get more leads and sales for your business. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.